Uh, hi everyone, welcome to my channel. So now I'm gonna talk about my group sets and why I decided to go with the Campagnolo setup on my Pinarello. And you can get the idea why I chose with this setup. Now if it's your first time here, hit that subscribe button right there. Cause I often do the videos on the bicycles and some of you can find them quite useful. I would say the majority. Now let me get to the subject right away and then you can uh, narrow down uh, what's happening. Now in my past, I have used the uh, SRAM uh, set up on my old uh, bicycles. And one thing that I noticed right away is that uh, uh, the shifters, or should I say the brake levers, were never uh, comfortable like on my campy setup. And let me just tell you what I'm talking about here. So this is the position that I ride right here. And I love to rest my uh, hand right here. I, uh, this kind of angle right here, I found this to be a perfect, a perfect resting spot when I'm riding, let's say from this angle like this, or, or if I go even, if, even if I go this way. I don't know why, but with the Shimano, I guess the, the hoods were a little bit straight. And um, I felt that my hand could slip, slip over. It didn't, it didn't have this bump right here. And one of the main reasons, uh, that's one of the reasons why I kind of felt that the Shimano setup gave me a better ergonomics here, if you know what I mean. And it also has this uh, a treading here that really kind of gives me a little bit of support here and it holds my fingers in place here. Now, since we are right there over there, if you see this shifter thing here, I should point it this way, right there, I would just click like on, on a Ferrari and boom, one click and it would, it would, it would shift. So one thing that you have to do with the Shimano is that you got to go this way and then you have to go this way to downshift. I kind of, I kind of felt that uh, uh, Campagnolo set up with this, with this push button here was a lot more uh, neater and, and that's it basically. And uh, that's pretty much this for the levers. Now here is the problem here that I have on this bike if I went with the Shimano. See, I have a really nice matte black color on this uh, Pinarello here. And if you look, I decided to go on a black and a gray here accents uh, on my front derailleur. I would say this is the best uh, uh, setup on a, on, a on, a, on a black bike that has a matte finish like this. And I really found it uh, nice and matching. Now, if I take you over here, I also paired it with the black uh, uh, real derailleur, which looks really nice. And that's 11 speed uh, uh, Campagnolo Athena setup which is something like um, Shimano Tigra. And this is basically that. So I'm pretty, I'm pretty impressed. I also like the levers over here. Uh, uh, sorry, uh, the, the brake, uh, uh, the brake uh, calipers. Now they're not the Campagnolo, they're uh, Pinarello most company, but I, but I found them to be uh, uh, nicely matching with the black uh, uh, matte uh, frame. And uh, that's pretty much that. Now, one thing that I also find a little uh, nice is that uh, I also like the uh, Campagnolo Heritage. You, you, don't, you don't get to see that many on the road. And, uh, and, 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 I, and, I, and I've been told they're a little bit pricier over Shimano. I don't know what that is, but uh, probably because uh, it's a little more uh, rare out there and a little more pricier to make. And I also selected the carbon as well. And uh, that's about that. I hope you found this useful. Like, subscribe, and take care. Bye-bye.